Alrighty guys and welcome to a tutorial on how to stew apple. Today I'm going to be using Granny Smith's. Uh, so what you're going to want to do first is peel them with your peeler. Uh, I'm using 10 apples so this is the recipe and measurements for a 10 apple um, recipe. So you're going to want your apples, you're going to want your peeler and you're going to want a container to put your peel in unless you want to do something else with it which you can always do. So um, stewed apple you can use for, like you can eat it by itself for like breakfast or dessert or something. Uh, you can also make it crumble out of it. Uh, if you guys want me to uh, do another video um, showing you how to do a crumble topping, uh, just leave it in the comments. And if there's enough comments then I might have a go at it. So just going to finish peeling my apples. And now we're going to start cutting up our peeled apples. Uh, you can cut them into either quarters or eighths, um, depends on what you want. Uh, I am cutting them and uh, if you're a kid I recommend getting a parent to chop it. That's what I did right here because I'd rather keep my fingers. Uh, so that pot that you can see me cleaning in the background is um, the pot that I'm going to be using. It doesn't have to be a massively big pot, just enough to hold the apples and the rest of the ingredients. I'm just going to show you the pot. So what we've got here is the apple slices in the pot. Um, so this is where you just put them when you're finished. Uh, we don't actually have it on the heat yet. Uh, just wait to put the rest of the ingredients on the heat. Um, so we're going to quickly speed through the rest of the apple cutting. So here you can see a pot full of cut up apples. So um, this is what, that's about the amount you want to have. So what sh the ingredients you're going to need is brown sugar, uh, those are cinnamon sticks, and vanilla essence or a vanilla pod if you have that. Uh, if you don't have cinnamon sticks you can always use ground cinnamon. Uh, so you just want one of them and you want a quarter of a cup of brown sugar for um, 10 apples and a cap full of vanilla essence. Uh, you're also going to want about a quarter to half a cup of um, water. Uh, that's just so it like stews properly and doesn't like burn. Um, so you want it on a relatively high flame. So uh, turn on the heat and put the lid on and let it cook for about um, five minutes and then come back and give it a nice stir. So this is after five minutes, uh, so you can see it's bubbling there. You want to give it a stir with a wooden spoon, just mix it around a bit, and then leave it for another minute or so. If you want it to be softer, you can leave it for a bit longer, uh, but it depends on what you want to do. So thanks for watching this tutorial, guys. hope it's been helpful. Uh, I hope you have some delicious stewed apple yourself. So thanks for watching, guys, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye!